Number 19. Find the domain and the range. Well, to find the domain, we need to set the denominator equal to 0. So look at your denominator. The denominator is 11 minus x. Set that equal to 0. Solve it for x. You have x is 11. Okay? Now that tells me what x can't be because we never want the denominator to be 0. And if you have 11 in there, you'll have 11 minus 11, you'll have 16 over 11 minus 11, which is 16 over 0, which will be undefined. So that tells me the denominator can be any other number but 11. And how do you write that interval notation? You write, start at the left, go to infinity, come up but don't touch the 11 and then union that with start at the 11 but don't touch the 11 and go right on the number line all the way to infinity okay so this is the way of saying let X uh, be any number but 11 now for the range if you put any number in there but 11 you'll get a fraction of some kind right now, the only thing this fraction will never, ever, ever be is 0. To get a 0 for this fraction, we're going to have to have a, a 0 on the top, aren't we? And that you don't have a 0 on top. You have 16 on the top. So the, this, this fraction will never, ever, ever equal to 0. How do we say that? X goes all the way from negative infinity. Don't touch the 0. Start at the 0 and go to plus infinity.